Hi, this is the Corsair HS75XB, a pretty good wireless Xbox headset, except for that it completely lacks a function to force restart it if it would for any reason lock up and stop working. Unfortunately, this is also something that is prone to happen. The headset can, for example, get stuck in a sort of trying to connect state if the Xbox is suddenly turned off at the wrong moment while gaming, leaving the headset completely useless with nothing but a white light on the side indicating that it is still on. However, since the headset completely lacks a force power off function, all you can do if this happens is to put the headset aside for a day or two until the battery has drained completely and then just charge it back up upon where the headset will work again just like nothing ever happened. Corsair has though realized that this is actually an issue and also released a firmware update to combat the problem with the headset getting put in this frozen state. To perform this update and not having to wait for a few days every time this happens, you will need a Windows computer, the headset in question, a USB-C to USB cable like the one you charge the headset with and an internet connection. First off, then on your computer, open any browser and go to the link in the video description. Then select to download the Corsair's IQ software that is used to update their accessories. After the pretty heavy file of just over 1GB is downloaded, install the program and restart your computer as prompted. After the computer is restarted, start the IQ software and plug your headset into an available USB port on your computer. A prompt should now appear that there is a firmware update for the headset. However, if it doesn't, you can also just click the big picture of the headset to get the firmware update dialog going as well. Now, click the update now button and follow the on-screen instructions to update the firmware on your headset. As the instruction makes clear, do not unplug the headset or restart the computer during the update process as it can potentially and worst case render the headset completely useless. So just leave it as it is and let it finish. After the update process has completed, you can now safely unplug the headset and hopefully you will not encounter the freezing issue anymore. If you come across any questions, I will do my best to answer them in the comments below. Thank you for watching. Have a nice day. Bye.